good morning <laughs> uh, it's around 8 a.m. in the morning I took out this little pooch she's currently destroying a toy as poochies do <laughs> um, it's Monday the 15th of February it's gorgeous gorgeous weather clear skies <laughs> and I am um, she already did everything she needed to so we are just playing a little bit enjoying the good weather and then I'm gonna have to go home because hopefully there's gonna be a delivery today see you in a sec <laughs> hello so it's not really a second later, it's more like six hours later. <laughs> I'm now at our afternoon walk. <laughs> We're playing with her toy, that yellow, that little yellow thing is her toy. Uh, enjoying the beautiful, beautiful weather. I already did um, work for the day and we had lunch uh, we had pasta with minced meat uh, so yeah that is a tea and uh, when I get home I will give you an update on my reading challenge for this year and uh, probably a bunch of other things that I have to update you on <laughs> so yeah see you soon hey hey so I'm uh at home on my bed. I did some reading. Uh, I am just chilling a little before I have to work again. Uh, so just to give you a little uh, update because I didn't say anything here uh, since the last video. Uh, I'm currently working from home fully. Uh, I'm a freelancer working as cus customer support and uh, that is that part then we have I have to give you an update for my reading challenge for this year which uh, I'm currently reading this book <laughs> I have a Toki next to me <laughs> uh, which that book in English it's called Divine Secrets of the Yaya Sisterhood um, and it's part of a Rory Gilmore reading challenge, which I found uh, kind of by accident, I think. It showed up on my Pinterest feed and I loved it because at the time I was also re-watching Gilmore Girls again, so it was perfect timing. <laughs> and I chose that to be my, um, ooh, my challenge for the year. So the idea is that I choose at least one book from the list uh, every month which I couldn't obviously read all of them because there is like 407 plus books <laughs> on that list so it's a little bit a lot to read in a year and so that is the tea for the reading challenge what else do I have to update you on the apartment is actually clean enough to for me to give you a tour uh, someday, but I think I'm gonna make a special video on that. Uh, but yeah, I now that I have more time, I would love to record more. I would love to like stay up and up to date and consistent with vlogging and recording and such. So hopefully, I will do that. Um, I, I've i been streaming technically every day now because I've been doing yoga every day. I've been following uh, Yoga with Adrian uh, channel and I've been doing yoga every day in the morning and streaming it while I'm doing it. Hi, uh, editing Lana here. Uh, just a, a little update on the yoga streams. I, due to uh, my internet having a data limit, uh, I won't be able to stream it every day anymore, but I will choose uh, two days 
uh, in a week that I will be streaming it. I will still do yoga every single day and will probably share a part of that journey on YouTube. Uh, but other than that, uh, two times in a week I will be on Twitch streaming it, morning yoga and chat. So if you'd like, stop by, follow, have fun. <laughs> uh, and enjoying it, loving it. So if you'd like to follow that for inspiration or if you'd like to follow me when I play games or anything on Twitch, I will have one unique link in the description where you can follow either my Twitch or Instagram if you wish, uh, or Twitter if you wish. So yeah, <laughs> you can follow me anywhere you'd like basically. So that is that. Oh, I have a TikTok. <laughs> I haven't started posting anything yet, but by the time this goes up, uh, there might be a few videos already up there. So link to that is also going to be in that one unique link that I mentioned. Hey, hey, so today is Wednesday, I'm, um, it's evening, it's 7 p.m. and I'm about to start my um, last work shift of the day. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to check in, uh, just say how my day was, also ask you how your day was. Um, I hope your guys' days so far were good, awesome, or if they were not good, or if you have been going through something, I am sending you all the support, all the love uh, possible, just to help you get through that. Uh, so yeah, a little bit of strength and support coming your way. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I went to the post office today, I had to send some uh, routers back because we had an extra internet that we haven't been using for a while and I was, we were kind of just waiting uh, the contract, for the contract to be done. Uh, so yeah, I did that. And uh, then I went to the library because I had to return a book that I was a little bit late for. <laughs> it's not that bad. I was only a few days late. So it was like, it's 50 lipa per day, which is very little. <laughs> um, so, and I was only a few days late, so it wasn't that bad. But I couldn't resist. <laughs> 
<laughs> getting out of the library without uh, taking a book with me. I don't know what it is. I just, for some reason, I feel like I have to have four books at home, um, which is the maximum that I can borrow from the library. So I don't know why. It just feels like that every time I go to the library, I feel the urge to borrow something. It's kind of like with book shopping, I guess, or stationary shopping for me. Uh, I just feel like the urge to get it. It's not like, it's not like I have to get it um, for the sake of getting it or anything like that. It's more like the, I don't know, the urge for reading, like the passion for reading. Even though I've I've been reading a bit slower lately, like I've started I've started January by reading pretty pretty fast. I've read five books almost like this, uh, which was pretty awesome for me. Uh, but then February has been a little bit slower. Not gonna lie, uh, but I'm still enjoying it anyway. Uh, still reading Divine uh, Sis Divine Secrets of the Yaya Sis Sisterhood. Um, I'm a little bit more than halfway through, I think, and hopefully I will try to finish it this week and maybe start a new one this week, because um, I do want to get into all of the books that I have from the library, <laughs> but I also want to get into the, some of the books that I have at home. <laughs> um, so that is one of the reasons that originally I didn't want to get anything from the library today because I have books at home that I want to read. <laughs> um, so yeah, I will... I think uh, for my next outing to the library I will hold off until like the... the date that, that I have to return some books and then I will re return like two or three books at once. So hopefully that will give me at least like a week or something uh, where I have some extra time to, hey, let's choose a book from home to read. Because, <laughs> I mean, I'll show you a little bit later. Hopefully I'll remember, but I have a book from um, by... Zoe Sag and Amy, I can't say her surname properly, so I can just write it like somewhere there. <laughs> but I have their book at home that has been waiting to be read. I have a bunch of books that have been waiting for years to be read. So, yeah. I would like to, re like, really, really like to dedicate some of my reading time to books that I have at home. <laughs> so yeah. And also, uh, I don't think I've mentioned it previously. Uh, I technically did record the first time that I went to get my nails done. It was uh, Lord of the Rings uh, style um, nails, so I... Uh, otherwise, these are my nails now, so it's uh, polka dots and roses here, and I love them. Um, it's holding up pretty good, it's been about almost about two and a half weeks since I did them. The only nail that's not holding up, I mean, the nail art is holding up somewhat, but it's this one. And it's only because it broke. I just want to focus, but yeah, you can see the nail broke. Uh, for whatever reason, it became really weak. And whenever I would touch a surface or just do anything, it would bend. Um, like really, really bend. So essentially just broke. Like all of my other nails are really firm. And like on touching them like this, they don't bend at all but that one did and unfortunately it broke but that's fine uh, like 
I'm sure when I go get them done next time, uh, my she's my friend, <laughs> uh, the the girl who does my nail nails. Um, she will probably just add in gel, and essentially we will wait it out until it grows back again. So that is the tea, and now I really have to go to work because <laughs> um, I don't want to work until like late in the evening. So yeah, I will see you probably after work because um, I want to show you my bookshelves and what I have on my bookshelves and what I would like to read. So that is the tea.